Well, so do you want me to just like explain what it is? Yeah. Uh, well, basically, I just tried to do like a, a deck organizer for uh, Magic cards, and I only did a specific deck because there's just too many to cover. I don't, I didn't think I could get that, so I just did a specific one, and this one is labeled uh, Double Double Toil and Trouble, and it shows you how many of the amounts of each card because there's 60 cards in a deck, and out of the 14, you need a certain amount of each kind. So this one, this particular titler shows how many you need for each of each card. And uh, on this page, you have to pick a hand, random hand of seven. And if you hit this pick random, it always gives you a random number of seven out of those 14. Why seven? Uh, it's just the rules of the game. I'm oh, not really okay. 100% sure. Yeah, it's how many you pull when you start. Oh, okay, so. got it. Yeah, that's how it works. Yep. You can, but I felt like that was too difficult for like uh, just kind of introducing how to do it. Yeah, you can, but yeah, but that goes down to six at that point, and it goes down every time. So, and with the contents, you can click on the uh, the transclude titler for each of these. And it's like the different creatures. How many? So I use like a table of contents type thing for this to just go through each of them. And each of these has its own thing. Some of them have less than others just because there's less of a type of card in this specific deck. So it's a little more boring than I wanted it to be, but to get it done in the time constraint, I didn't think it was worth trying to fit everything and have it make sense. So there's all those. It's just uh, like a table of contents of each type of card. Can, can we see enhancements? The code for it? Yep. It basically sh says like what it is here. Like that's just the text. And then I use the table of contents. So is that... So Okay, so that's enhancements. Can we see the code for... What is enhancements? Oh, it's just like a type of card. Yeah, so, do, so okay, so it's a type. Can we see the code for another type of card, which would be maybe artifacts, right? Yeah. Which is exactly the same except for the word artifacts. Yep, okay. and the ones with more of them are a little like this one. This one's a little different just because there's more of them. No, it's not. The well, code's not, not different. Yeah, the code's not different. Right. No. Okay. Yeah, I use the same thing for those. So, uh, where am I headed with this comment? This line of commenting? So, hmm? so, how, so if you see the same code, this is, it's good, but what could um, Ben have done here? Right, if we're, if we, let's, I should have made this game for the whole semester. I should have made you buy lines of code. Because right, the less code you have, the more efficient your program is. Mm -hmm. So it should, it costs you. It costs if we're running a company. The more code you have, the more I have to pay you. So how could we have had less code here? Yeah. Yeah. What what would the template have looked like? Or what would how would you build a template now? Uh, you would use the original code in one thing and just have it extend over multiple titlers. So you. Yeah. So how would we know which tiddlers it would apply to? Yeah, so you would tag lands. Yep, into this one. Card type. Mm -hmm. And what was the other one? Uh, card type and then, yeah. What? Yeah, there is this one. Artifacts, and lands, like enchantments, the, those, all those. Yeah, there's like seven card types. They'd all get tagged card type, and, and then, then that code here, the macro call, would go in the template, and you'd replace where it says tag equals lands. You'd replace that with what? With, with whatever you wanted it to be tagged with. Like I do the artifacts, the enchantments, 
creatures, that kind of what, stuff. What is the, where would you get that value? It's the title of the tiddler. Yeah. So you'd say tags equals, instead of quote lands, it would be curly brace, curly brace, exclamation point, exclamation point, title, curly brace, curly brace. Else? Pardon? Everything else would just be in the fields, right? Everything else is exactly as you got it. You're just you're just sifting through it. So, um, and then the first line of the template would be dollar sign list mm -hmm. filter equals is current tag card type. So now we're on the card type and the field value title or the field value current tiddler is the name of your card type lands etc. So that's how you could do it. Yeah. So that would be you could still do that. That's cool. Yeah, that's like, yeah, okay. But and then, the, and then when you want the value of doing that is that when you didn't like this mm -hmm. or in a context where you have a boss and you're getting paid and the boss says, like, um, let's try instead of tabbed internal nav, let's try the, let's do tabs instead of table of contents. So we do tabs. Okay. Ben's going to say, i got to change it to seven places. With Instead of just one, you just change it in one. Place. Okay, so it just condenses everything. Yeah, you cut the amount of code. If you have right now, you have five lines of code times seven card types. Where I can just have lines. five. Where you I can just have, have five in one. In one, right? Okay. Yeah, and that's template. So yeah, and you could you could do that would take you not much time. Yeah, no, that would be yeah. really cool. Yeah, and tabs actually might be nicer. I I hate the I don't know I've got. <laughs> Tabs would be interesting to see. Oh, yeah, definitely. Like. And then you can play with different formats and change the kind of interactivity by changing it in one place. And that's that's template. So, yeah, thanks. Cool. And let me see. Do the random. Show us the random and how that yep. works. The random works down here. It's a button. It just says pick random. So that's just that. Mm -hmm. And then everything we do, it was just a set field, essentially, in a list. So see, this is similar, I think, to what you're doing, right? In some respects, because what Ben does here, if you, he sets seven tiddlers. First card, second card, third card, fourth card, fifth card. And then he uses those later when he wants to say, what should I do with it? And this is just a display. And so you, what he does is he sets the value of the seven tiddlers, card one through card seven, dollar sign colon slash one through dollar sign colon slash seven, and tags them all for the cards picked. Mm -hmm. And it displays the current tiddler based on the what's picked. And then, it, and then it looks and says, show me all the cards that are picked and present them. So they're always going to be one through seven, but every time you hit random, it rewrites those seven tiddlers. Mm -hmm. I think that's where you're, you're, you're doing something like that. Every time you press one of your up, down, left, right buttons, we want to rewrite Hitler's. Right. Uh, the problem is, I can't rewrite it. Yes, you can. You haven't yet. Every time I try to extend the code in order to do it in a different way, it all boils down to needing the same bit of code, and that same bit of code does not work. Hmm. Yeah. Did you try? It, it, I know it, it's there. It's we're we're not quite getting there yet. Well, the stuff that you gave me, if I wanted to make that work that way, would just use the same line of code that I was using. Yeah. Well, I didn't that finish line of code it. Okay. Does not work. We're gonna get yeah. it. Eventually, you might need JavaScript. It might be that you need a piece of JavaScript. If I could do it with a single line of JavaScript, you can do JavaScript. Oh yeah. I don't know how to do it yet. I cannot look it up. Oh, we're we'll right in JavaScript. Yeah, JavaScript's very and then easy. And it just comes right in. Yeah. Yeah, okay, thanks. So yeah. Did we get to, I lost your clock. Yeah, it's 10, 10 11. Perfect. Okay. Awesome. Um, so, what else could we ask Ben? Tagging, starting with tagging, lists of seven cards. I used the transcoding to get them to you list. Get to the Hmm? Look at all the links. <laughs> yeah, he's, um, I have a lot. <laughs> right. Be here for another ten minutes. Really, right. <laughs> the, well, you click keep creatures as a link. Yes. Right. That's a link. So that's the only place he shows us links. Yep. Right. Okay. Yeah. And um. Okay.
Um, but yeah, I would build the templates. That would be kind of oh, yeah, that would be to, that would be interesting, isn't it? And it would work way easier, I think. Yeah, when you do the templates, then then switch from talk to tabs and see what you like better. But wait till you do the templates; you only have to switch it one place. Yep. Um, yeah, and this is extensible, right? You can buy. You can just add more cards or more decks or bigger decks yeah. or whatever it is, right? You can have multiple decks in the same thing. You could. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know how to do this. <laughs> like, you got it pretty much. <laughs> yeah, but you can write. You get it. I still don't get it. Like, how can you only have a deck of fourteen cards? It's 14 specific cards, but you can have more of than one of a specific card. It adds up to 60. So what? Yeah. Oh, I yeah, you have more than one of certain I'm cards. You have 60 cards. Because I just don't get it. Yeah, like in this one, I explained. Yeah, like you need 12 of a Swamp card. You need three of the Bloodhunter Bat. You need three of the Mold Adder. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Someday I'll get it. <laughs> what game is this? Magic the Gathering. Oh, this is the magic cards, right? Yep. Okay. Does there? Can you play this game digitally? Yeah, there is a digital version of it. Is it any it's good? Quite it's quite a few, right? I think what's coming out with people after a couple of years or so for a while. Is it an open source game or no? Uh, I mean, the card the cards are open source or no? You can totally recreate it. There's no idea. We could recreate it in this if we really wanted to. No. Yeah. Have to spend money. You have to give this company money to get their cards. So they don't, they don't have to yes. Yes and no. It depends on yeah. Depends on whether it's legal or not. Okay, thanks. Who is ten fifteen? Do we have anyone that's ten fifteen? Who else is today? 